This video was sponsored by Ren, more on that later. Hi, acting. What does it mean? Some people would say it's when you are in front of a camera and you talk to it. Some would call me an actor. This award uh, would tell you that too. But there is actually an entire sect of TikTok that also considers themselves to be actors. How many awards did they win, huh? Not as many as me. A lot of people have talked about different acting POVs on TikTok, but I haven't had the chance to do that yet, so. I wanna. POV stands for point of view, but when you're acting, it's the point of view. POV TikToks are very strange, obviously. You have POV uh, eating food. You have POV uh, breakups. You have POV uh, superheroes. POV therapy. POV P. POV P. POV. Like you're in the toilet and like you're the POV. POV on the, on the inside of the toilet getting the pee on you. That's real. But like I said today, I wanna to talk about acting POVs because it's like this very insular situation that doesn't ever happen, ever. Like if you're an actor, you're not just like sitting in your room talking to your phone, right? Is that not, do they make movies like that now? Is that how they filmed the newest Star Wars? But before we get into it, here's a word from today's video sponsor. Today's video is sponsored by Ren. It is 105 degrees outside my room and it gets your mind on the oncoming climate crisis. Ren is a public benefit company with a mission to unlock the collective action of individuals against the climate crisis. Since 2019, they've raised over $1 million in funding to projects planting trees, protecting rainforests, and otherwise fighting the climate crisis. What you're able to do on Ren.co is take a survey to calculate your carbon footprint and then learn how to reduce it with monthly contributions to carbon reduction projects. CO2 emissions are part of everyone's lifestyle, even if you don't have a car. It's part of everyday life and is an unfortunate reality. But with Ren, you're able to at least understand your impact on the environment and contribute in ways to offset it. Once you sign up for a contribution, you get monthly updates on how all the projects that you're supporting are going. So you know that your contribution is going to a consistent project. Many of you know that I live in California and the wildfires in the last few years have gotten devastating. Ren members are actually able to support a program called Biochar, which is not only a wildfire preventative, but also a carbon storage solution. The Biochar works by taking dead and flammable trees and turning that biomass into the biochar, which is like a big rock of carbon that prevents that carbon from leaking out into the atmosphere and obviously prevents further wildfires. The climate crisis is something that affects each and every one of us and will continue to for the foreseeable future. It'll take a lot to end climate change, but if you want to have a hand in repairing local environments all around the world, go to my link ren.co slash start slash Ethan is online to start tracking your carbon footprint and learn how to offset it. The first hundred people who sign up will have 10 extra trees planted in their name and I think that's a great thing. Again, it's ren.co. Link is in the description and thank you so much to Ren for sponsoring this video. Let's get back to it. A lot of the acting TikToks I find involve some weird like caption situation. Like you only have a certain number of years above your head and uh, you have to spend the spend the years. And then it's, it's kind of just that format, but like for everything, for like words, um, colors, Oh, I can't believe I don't have any powers. Oh my god. Grandma, you were right. I'm a wizard. I just cast my first spell. That wasn't your first. What do you mean? I've never been able to do magic before. Listen, when you were two, I was taking care of you, and the house started shaking like an earthquake. I didn't know what was happening until I realized it was you. So why are you telling me this now? Because I was scared. I'd never seen a baby do that before. <laughs> How do you know it wasn't just an earthquake? You don't see earthquakes. The fucking grandma voice cracks me up too. Never seen a baby do that before. And like, see the baby do what? Was he fucking just like? <laughs> <laughs> baby was just fucking making the whole house shake with his little hands. So I do have powers? Of course, it's all about controlling your emotions. So you gonna win this family competition? I don't know, Jay's too powerful. Your brother's nothing compared to you. For round three, you'll need to freeze the water. Well done, Jay. What? How? Because I'm the better wizard. Or not. Or not. What? There's so much going on here. You got like a family competition? What? Is that a bubble? Well, you still gotta freeze it. <laughs> it just ends. It just ends. Now that was some good acting. Oh my god. This guy's account's awesome. Excuse me, that bad. 69 times? Oh my god. Devin, how many times have you walked past the murder? 69 times. Why so many? I don't know. I gotta stop going on those books. Hey kiddo, you want some candy? Um, nah, I'm good. Are you sure? You're missing out. Wait, that guy was a murderer? Did he just try to poison me? Yo, Devin, your mom texted you. No way, you found my phone? Yo, our meter just went up. Damn, I wonder who it is. Thank the Lord. Hey, yo, what? For not killing us. Oh, facts. 
Mommy there? I'm glad you made it, Devin. She's actually out right now. That's weird. She texted me to come home. Huh. That is weird. Did he smile at the end? Put up the last frame of the TikTok. That was a smile. He was the murderer all along. Every time he walked by the mirror, it went up. That's like, there's, that's like, the premises of this guy's TikToks are like so absurd that like, half, it, like I don't even understand what I'm looking at until like, it's already halfway over. Hey, can you see what my son has been buying? You got a picture of him? Vapes. What? Oh, I'm gonna kill him. Frankie, come here, I'm spanking your ass. Oh my God. This guy's signature is just going, oh my God. That's how you know he's a good actor. <laughs> I wonder what things Mrs. Wilson buys. I have no idea. Dude, just use your power. What? What is it? Shaft 69 Oh, those are the best. Uh, uh? Kind of weird to do that. <clears throat> kind of invasive. Freak that has that weird power, right? I bet you 100 bucks you can't guess what my mom's last purchase was. Fish and chips. She's in England, huh? What? She's on her business trip there. What? She's on a business trip there. You know she only eats fish and chips at a business trip. Hey, can you help me out? My dad hasn't texted me all day. Do you need a picture of him? Nah, I know his face. <laughs> Hello, honey. Your mother. She passed away. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What an actor. <laughs> he, bought, he bought a casket. Police. What? I didn't do anything wrong. Relax, kid. The chief wants to talk to you. My son went missing last night. Can you help me track him down? I'll do my best. What? It's not working. What do you mean? Is it because it was like a drawing? Is it because he's dead? I'm sure there's a part two and three and four or something. What a horrible power. Imagine like having any power and you have the power to see what someone's last purchase was. Like, my last purchase was a fucking cherry limeade from the Sonic Drive-In. What the fuck does that tell you about me? Mom, what's a superfood? It gives you an ability, but be careful. Once you finish your item, your powers are gone. What the hell? I got a hunk of broccoli? Mmm. This is so good. Devin, you better not be horsing down your superfood. Elon, are you sure you're gonna pay me back? Yes, bro. I'm just really thirsty. All right. Thank you so much. Oh, let's be friends, too. <laughs> Yo, my superfood's a wiener. That's kind of weird, Frank. Well, I love it, because it gives me super speed. What? I wish I got a wiener. Bro, the new teacher is so hot. I know, but she's way out of your league. Oh. What's happening? What's his power? It just, like, shows text on his on his head? Dude, I heard your superfood allows you to see someone's future. Can you see mine? Is it anything good? Nah, dude, you're gonna be homeless. <laughs> He's gonna be homeless. <laughs> Damn, I feel bad for that kid. Oh, oh, who the hell are you? Who are you? I'm Jason Bourne. What? Son? Dad, come with me. You're in danger. What? Jason Bourne doesn't time travel? This guy doesn't know anything. There are so many comments asking for a part two. Why? Why do you need more of this? <laughs> I'm sure there's a part two and three and four. Honey, how many letters do you have? I got three. Remember, you only have two guesses a day, so choose wisely. Yep. Everything is so contrived. What, what, this doesn't make any sense. You have two letters. You gotta guess the rest. Um... The first person to guess the password above their head wins. Whatever the fuck that means. <sighs> huh? Am I blind? Devin, Frank will be driving you to school today. What? I hate Frank. He's so weird. Hello there. So how do you like being blind, Devin? Frank, just zip it. Over here, dumbass. Hey, give me back my glasses. Yo, look at Devin's blinks. Oh my god, what happened? Ew, ah, what's wrong with you? I'm sorry. Okay. I don't want that anymore. My name's Four. Four like the number? Exactly like the number. Exactly like the number. <laughs> hey, these guys are actors, not writers. <laughs> exactly like the number. It's just the number four. That's what's on my birth certificate. What happened? One, two, three, we're taken. What's your name? Christina. First lesson you learn from me. What? If you want to survive, just keep your mouth shut. The music is way too- What? That's a really fucked up thing to say. <laughs> she just made fun of your name, bro. Maybe get a better one. The new recruit tries to embarrass the leader in front of everyone. Everyone's there. Can't you see? Go to school or stay home. What? Looks like I don't really have an option then, does it? Why would you- Whatever. Hey, Dak, can I get a ride? Sure thing, buddy. On second thought, oh, where are we going? Never mind. What is this? Life is a game of episode. The more gems you have, the better decisions you are given. That's not true. The more gems you have, the better decisions you're given. That's not true. The more gems you have, the better decisions you can make. I guess that's like an, a an allegory for capitalism, but like it also doesn't make any sense because his dad was like, yeah, sure, let's go. And he was like, never mind. I can't. If his dad was like, you don't have enough gems, asshole, then it would be good. Then this would make so much more sense. I'm getting cardio. It's probably for the best. You've been looking a little puffy. Puffy? Yo, you coming with? I don't have enough diamonds. Who cares, man? Watch, just click it anyway. 
B, just pay it back later. So like I'm in debt? Yeah, what's the worst that could happen? Yo, come on guys, I got a rest at Chili's. You got a reservation at Chili's? Do they even do those? Duh. Come to what, bro, amigo? Uh, nah, I'm good, man. I'll just hang out here. Help! Someone getting mugged in broad daylight. I'm being- <laughs> Someone getting mugged in broad daylight? I talk like this because, uh... <laughs> I really need to clear my throat. Why is why are they always wearing backpacks? Like I kind of get it for the last guy who was doing all these weird school ones. He like looks a little younger, even though he literally looks like he's in his mid twenties. This guy looks like he's thirty. <laughs> you can't be you can't be like oh, I'm going to school, Dad. Give me a ride to school, Dad. You're seventy years old. <laughs> Mom. Someone help her. You with the blue shirt. I'm literally the only one here. The only one around. Hell. Damn it. Things just happen. Things just happen in these TikToks, and there's just like no, there's no reason for it. It doesn't make any sense. It's just the, like there's no like conclusion. There's no like foreshadowing. Things just happen, and then it's over. Kind of like life in a lot of ways. Is that all? That will be thirty words. I'm starving. Please, no words, no food. Pay or get out. Wait, I'll pay. You seem like a sweet girl who's trying to help herself out today. Is your lucky day. I'm giving you infinite words oh. for the rest of your life. <laughs> Congratulations. Today is your lucky day. I'm giving you infinite words. But she's but she's speechless. She has infinite words and yet she doesn't even know what to say. Except, oh, I love acting. Ansley, get this. And this for me, duh. You guys are so unfair. You never helped me when I was starving. Well, now you have infinite words, so bias this, we need stuff for when we meet the prince. What? What the fuck? I get, like, people not being good to you, and because you have more than them, I guess. But, like, if you have infinite words, it's kind of fucked up to not help people with, like, food is, like, 30 words or whatever. You have infinite. Fuck off. I don't feel bad for you. For dinner tonight, we can go to Hibachi. Ooh, that really fancy place? Yes, and Ansley pays. Tell me why. Why do you use me? Because you're you, and you have infinite words. I wish I never told you I had infinite words. Wait, did you just say you have infinite words? Do you know what that means? What does that mean, random guy? Is that all? What? <laughs> I thought it was gonna keep going. What's going on? Finish your story. <laughs> like, like end it. Why do they all just not have like a conclusion? I feel bad about what happened. So you're apologizing? Yes. I'm sorry. Okay. I don't forgive you. Herb, I said I'm sorry. Yeah. And I do not forgive you. This one's weird because it's like I'm constantly like looking back and forth between these the two like takes, I guess. And it's like this is, I guess, more acting than the other ones. But this is the weird sect of acting TikTok where they don't actually say anything. Where like I would argue that most of acting is like line delivery and they're just lip syncing. So like... This is just a song that you're playing. Like half the time they aren't even reacting. The guy in the back kind of go went like one time. You're just like standing there while a song plays. Is she your girlfriend girlfriend or y'all just talking? Actually. Bitch, if I kill you, are you dead dead or just not breathing? She said it. I don't think kids should be allowed to go on the internet. Me as a girlfriend. What I especially don't understand about these kinds of TikToks are like the scene that they're setting up doesn't make a lot of sense at all. Like he's standing there eating his like fucking Pocky or whatever. And then she's like over here, like on the phone or something. She's like, what are you doing? Talking to my boyfriend who's all the way over there. <laughs> Yo, ladies, that moment when he, like, sing to you manipulative. Can you show us going from happy to crying?
everything about that. Like, I guess it's fine to like teach people how to like cry on command. It just looks creepy. You just look creepy. You have to acknowledge that. You look creepy. Sorry, not, not my fault. If you wanna stop me, you're gonna have to fucking kill me! <laughs> this is, is he okay? <laughs> he just like went to sleep. Night night. <laughs> understand what this means even like I get it you get almost half a million likes because you just put the signs on there in any random order you could put any fucking like oh yeah fucking Virgo is the one that's like kind of whatever and then a water sign Pisces is the one that's like all pissed off sure whatever <laughs> none of that fucking matters you could easily switch them up and people would be like yeah dude I'm just like that <laughs> When someone hurt me, I used to get sad. Now, I take a shit. <laughs> but it's cool, I checked out. Oh, you wanna be friends now? Okay, let's put my fake face on and pretend now. Sit around and talk about the good times. That didn't even happen. I mean, why are you laughing? Must have missed that joke. Let me see if I can find a reaction. TikTok acting versus real acting. TikTok acting just means that you uh, move your head a little bit, but real acting, you don't move your head during that. There's something so funny to me about people just like lip syncing like scenes from movies and like songs and shit while staring at their phone. When in reality, you know that like when they're recording it, I guess it might be coming out of like their phone speakers. I don't really, I don't know how TikTok works. But like imagine walking in on someone just being like, just like no sound at all. Which one got betrayed? Both in different ways. Uh. <laughs> Boys at school never look at me. Taylor's the one they look at. Which side is insecure? This is a weird trend that I've only found recently. It's like, which side is, is this? Which side is that? I just don't care. These kinds of videos, I think, lead people to believe that they're actually better at analyzing body language and facial movement than they actually are. When it's like, neither side is insecure. You're acting and it's like from the chest up. So what body language is there to read? Like, I guess you could try to act insecure, but that's like a hard thing to illustrate. You know what I mean? Left, the body language says insecure and anxious. True, it does say that. Look, look at it. It says it right on there. Yeah, I bet it looks pretty fucking weird when I took the music out because it is weird. It's just weird to do things like this. Like, I don't know. I just don't, I just don't understand what the appeal is. When you gonna be on Netflix, my guy? When this guy gonna be on Netflix? Guys, look, he can act sad. POV after we argued, hashtag viral. Oh my God, this is taking so long. Christ, that was like fucking 10 minutes, bro. <laughs> How is that acting? Like, it's just not. It's acting in the same way that like playing pretend as a kid is acting. <laughs> Ugh. How is that acting? That's not acting. You just fucking fucking ate her face. Just, ah. <laughs> Come on. And the rest was history of bed eyes emoji. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? Guys, for real, can I join? Nah, JK. I love cheering on my girlfriend. Now that's acting. 
My name, is, my name is April Kepner. I'm 28 years old. I, I was born on April 23rd in, in Ohio. I'm from Columbus, Ohio. My mom, my mom is a teacher and my dad is a farmer. Corn. Corn. Corn is a corn farmer. He farms corn. Please. I don't know what the fuck scene from what movie this is. Grey's Anatomy. I don't know. But like, don't do this. Like, m just make something. Just fucking do it yourself. If you can cry, if you can cry on command, and if you can make yourself like this emotional on command, why can't you just like make a scenario? Oh wait, when they try to do that, it doesn't make any sense. Soul makes body count. What's with all of these? Zero. Aw, that's precious. Now. Where were no, we? Please, no. Nah, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like any of that. I wonder what she's like. I should get her flowers. Humans like flowers. Oh, I hope she's a human. Hello, fellow freaks. Did you find out your soulmate's body counts? Yeah, mine's at 69. Must be really skilled. Wow. That's cute. Mine's got 420. Wait, you guys are celebrating? Why wouldn't we? What's yours at? Zero. Yo, his soulmate has to be a human. What's wrong with that? Hey, Dad, what was Mom's body count before y'all met? Uh -huh. A thousand. <laughs> What? Oh, I get it. It's body count, murder kind of body count, not like sex body count. That's funny. And it's acting, if you think about it. Why, son? Well, because mine's at zero. I thought it was, you know, really cute because she's saving herself for me. It's not that kind of body count, you imbecile. What? It's how many people she's killed. So she knows every time I... Yep. Huh? Yeah, huh is right. What? She brought a hundred people back to life? just in that moment none of these trends make any fucking sense i just don't understand who watches them this isn't me trying to like shit on these people or trying to have like a good time i guess it's just like bad content like there's just so much you could do that's not this i just don't understand i just don't get it I really don't. I just don't understand why people feel the need to like play pretend so much on the internet. Like the thing that bothers me the most about things like this from TikTok is I feel like it does kind of stifle creativity in a lot of ways. Like when people see trends like this, they just want to do it more. Some of these TikToks had 2 million likes. Like it reaches a lot of people. But ultimately if someone wants to be like a filmmaker or an actor or a writer, like doing this is like counterintuitive to the way that like it's actually done. There's nothing wrong with enjoying it. I just think it's weird and lame. Yep. Anyway, that was a short and sweet one, but uh, I'm getting ready for Anime Expo this weekend, so forgive me. If you want to say hi, I'll be at Anime Expo um, on the first and the second, so cool, fun, say hello. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please click like if you had a good time, or subscribe for more videos just like this every week. Make sure to stay tuned for my next video, where I learn how to act. Bye. Thank you so much to my incredible supporters over on Patreon. If you'd like to join the Patreon, it's $5 a month for video thumbnails the day before a video comes out, as well as your name at the end of every video just like this. Thanks.